Google Assistant Accessibility Videos Control your smart home with the Google Assistant. Requires compatible devices. Hello, my name is Patrick Clary, and I'm a product manager on the Google Accessibility Engineering team. Today I'd like to show you some features that use the Assistant to control smart home devices by voice. Being a wheelchair user, these make it very easy for me to control different things around my home. For example, I have a Nest Learning thermostat, which is a smart thermostat connected to my home Wi-Fi network. I can control it using the Nest app on my phone or using the Google Assistant. For instance, I can say, okay, Google, set the entryway temperature to 75 degrees. Sure, setting the entryway to 75 degrees. In some homes, the thermostat might be installed high in the wall, which makes getting to it in a wheelchair difficult. Controlling the thermostat with the Google Assistant is much easier. For people with vision impairments or who are blind, using a thermostat can be especially difficult. Very few thermostats are accessible for these users. In this case, using the Google Assistant provides much needed accessibility. Smart lights are another category of devices that you can control using your Google Assistant. For example, I can say, OK, Google, turn on the living room lights. Sure, turning three lights on. We're using Philips Hue lights for this demo, but there are a wide range of lights that the Google Assistant supports. I also happen to have the Nest Hello video doorbell and a Nest Aware subscription. Using the Nest app, I can assign names to faces and will recognize people as they approach. My Google Assistant on Google Home will tell me who's at my door. Kieran is at the door. That's my colleague Kieran. Since I have a smart door lock, I can unlock my front door using the assistant as well. OK, Google, unlock the front door. Can I have your security code to unlock the front door? 2035. OK, unlocking the front door. If your TV is Chromecast enabled, if someone unknown is at the door, you can ask the Google Assistant to show the video feed from your doorbell. Someone's at the front door. OK, Google. Who's at the door? You got it. Streaming the front door on living room TV. Since the smart home devices are connected to the Google Assistant via my Google account, I can control them when I'm away from home using my phone. One other useful feature of the Google Assistant is routines. With routines, I can have my Google Assistant perform multiple actions with just a single command. For example, I can say, OK, Google, good morning, and have it set the temperature to 72 degrees, turn on the coffee maker, turn up the lights, play me the news, and tell me about the weather. Routines can be customizable and can even be set for a fixed time. Hey, Google, good morning. Hi, Patrick. It is 10.50 AM. Right now in Mountain View, it's 57 and sunny. Today, it'll be sunny with a forecasted high of 70 and a low of 43. Have a wonderful day. These are some of the ways that the Assistant can take away the stress of your daily tasks. For more ways that the Google Assistant can help you in your daily life, check out the videos in the rest of the series, linked in the description below. We love to hear from our users. So if you have any comments or feedback about the accessibility features of the Google Assistant, Google Home, or other Google products, feel free to email us at disability-support at google.com, tweet us at Google Access, or for a complete list of accessibility support options, visit our website at support.google.com slash accessibility.